Okay, let's see how to download a file on Windows, specifically a file that doesn't automatically download when you click on the link, like when you install a new program or app. First of all, you should be using the Chrome browser, not Internet Explorer or Firefox or Opera. We found some issues downloading files with those programs, but not so much with Chrome. So I'm going to download one of the Starter Jupyter Notebooks from our course website on GitHub. First thing is I'm going to do, I'm going to navigate to the file itself. Why don't we do this lecture notes on lists. It's going to render as if it was in a Jupyter Notebook, but this is not what we want to download. We actually want to download the raw source code. So there's a button here that says raw. I'm going to click on that. And it's going to take me to the source code. Now it looks a little weird, but that's okay. When it opens up on your computer, you'll be fine. To download it, I'm actually going to go to my keyboard and hit Control and S at the same time. That's Control and S. When it does that, I get this dialog box that says it's going to download to Embellus and Desktop. It's going to call the file lecture underscore list.ipymb because that's what it tells me. I click on the Save button and I get this little dialog here that says it saves as lecture underscore list.ipymb.txt. That's fine. In a later video, we'll see how to move the file and rename it.